Some patients are plagued by kind of this proportion uh, of their body where one part of the body is actually much larger than the rest. And in Asians, some patients, uh, it is concentrated in the calf region. I mean, they may be extremely thin, but in the calf region, it's mostly composed of muscle. And so if the muscle there is kind of overdeveloped, then their calf looks kind of out of place. So a very good procedure to sort of reduce the size of the calf because it's muscle is using neuromodulators. So neuromodulators, um, what they do is they make the muscle weaker so that it atrophies over a period of time. And for calf muscles, it actually requires a substantial amount of these neuromodulators, but it does work very well. In terms of a more permanent solution, like surgery, although that there are some procedures that's described and is currently being done in Asia, uh, it's kind of frowned upon here in the West because some of the complications that it actually has. And they are composed of either partial muscle resection or actually disrupting the nerves that innervate those muscles. Here in the US, a non-surgical way of reducing the cap uh, are utilizing the neuromodulators.